Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am so excited to be sharing another fun and cozy Halloween night with you all. For today, we are going to be baking and decorating some cupcakes as well as building a fort. I really hope that you guys stick around and if you are new here, don't forget to subscribe to see more content like this. So to start off, I am prepping my cake batter that I purchased from Target and I will link everything down below for you guys so that you can purchase it as well. And honestly, I wish that I could do things from scratch, but your girl is a whole mom and sometimes we just aren't in the mood or we don't have the energy after a very long day of chasing the kiddos around. So for tonight, I opted for some boxed mix and I'm just calling it a day. So now that my batter is fully mixed, I'm going to go ahead and place it on this cupcake sheet and I found it so much easier to pour it into this measuring cup. It just made it a lot easier to pour into the cups than try and do it with the big bowl. So once the oven was done preheating, I placed the cupcakes inside to bake. And now that that's baking, it is time to start building our fort. Now I know some of you might think that I'm a little too old to be doing things like this, but you're only as old as you want to be. As a kid, I always dreamed about being an adult so that no one could tell me what to do. I didn't dream about paying the bills or washing the dishes. I wanted to make a mess and not get yelled at. That was, that was my kid dream. So now that I'm in my own home, I can literally tear down my living room for a dang fort and no one's gonna tell me not to. So you bet I'm gonna build one. So anyways, um, while I started, the cupcakes were done. It was a very, very quick process. So I pulled those out, made sure that they were completely baked in the inside by poking it with a little like wooden uh, toothpick. And since those were ready, I pulled them out for them to cool down. And while that was cooling down, obviously I continued with my fort. And this wasn't as easy as I thought it would be. It's been a very long time since I built a fort. I'd probably say it was like, it's been like 10 years since I last built one. So this was a little bit of a challenge for me, of course, and I didn't have a lot of blankets available. Um, so this is kind of what I had to work with. And then I started decorating now that I had a cute little like nook inside of this area. So I brought all of my Halloween decor. I brought pumpkins, pillows, a bunch of stuff. And then with the blankets that I had, I started laying them out to make it super cozy in here. So now that everything is decorated, I wanted to share this really awesome projector. Oh my gosh, you guys, this thing is the coolest thing I've ever owned. And this company is actually kind enough to send it over to me. And I'm so happy they did because this is literally what made this whole night. So this little mini projector is so cool. It comes with a remote and it has instructions and everything. It has literally everything you need to connect anything you want. So um, anyways, this one has a bunch of ports. It has an HDMI, VGA, VA, I think. And then it also has a really cool vent so it doesn't overheat. But basically this projector is like 
the coolest thing I've ever had, literally, and not even a joke. It was so cool, and the quality of it is actually so nice. It's almost like as good as my TV. So anyways, it was super easy to install and get running, so I just plugged it into the wall, and then I connected it, turned that bad boy on, and then I placed something under to level it or against the wall, and then I used a little knob to uh, make sure that it wasn't blurry. And then I connected my Apple TV, but like I said, you can either stream from your phone, you can use a fire stick or anything. So yeah, anyways, I pulled up Netflix on my Apple TV and we just had like a little Halloween marathon, which was super, super fun. Um, but now that I have that set up, I'm gonna go and finish up my cupcakes, of course, so that we can eat those while we're watching our movies. So this frosting I also picked up at Target and it's just a Funfetti green frosting. And I put this inside a piping bag so it'd be easier to put onto the cupcakes. And then I don't have any strategy to this. Like I said, I'm not a big baker and I honestly like I'm the worst at it. So I just kind of did what I could added frosting in a way they kind of look like poop monsters which is so funny but um it turned out really well honestly i'm very proud of what i did but um i added some sprinkles that already came with this package and then it also had these really cute eyes and now that you actually look at it it does look like a poop monster please let me know in the comments if i'm not crazy because they literally <laughs> they look like poop monsters which is pretty cool honestly it doesn't matter I guess it's kind of Halloween-y. Um, but yeah, you guys, that's literally it. We had such a fun night and we were watching movies all night. We watched this one, we watched Twilight. It was honestly really fun. So if you guys are interested in checking out the projector, I will link it down below for you guys. And also I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you next time.